Let's see how to create a true false question. Double click on the test container to open the editor and once the test has already been created, click on the true false icon. Under the test, an item is created with the new question. By clicking on it, appears in the right hand side a new window to edit this new question. Clicking next to the field name, we can access the properties of the question and change its internal name. Click here to change the wording of the question and click OK. Similarly, we can edit the test of the answers. Click on a response option and click on this icon. Using these options, we can alter the order of the answers or access the properties of the text of the answers. Do not forget to mark the correct answer. In doing so, the weight of this response automatically switches to 1. The maximum score of the question is also automatically changed. We mark the question as critical if it's necessary to answer it correctly to pass the test, regardless of the total score. If we wish, we can enter a message that will appear as feedback and will be different depending on whether the answer to the question is correct or incorrect. Once all the changes have been made, close the editor and preview the page to check the correct operation of the test. We can try to evaluate what happens when we answer the question correctly and incorrectly.